Okay, so here we are and we're going to learn a new trick. With Biggie on my left side, we generally um, start our healing process, which means walk with me with my left foot. So as you can see in some of the videos, if you watch, he's on my left side and I always start walking with that left foot. It's kind of like the gas pedal. Um, so when I want him to go with me, that left foot is what I lead with. When I stop, he does an automatic sit, and today we have started doing sit stays. So you notice that I stepped away using that right foot instead of the left. So with him on my left side, I stepped away with my right foot. So I'm gonna walk around him. This is the first time I've done it, um, and I'm only about like two foot lengths away from him so I'm, I'm just right in front of him if he were to move away I could easily manipulate to get him back in space I'm gonna have him look at me yes go boy so I can give him a treat I want his focus to stay on me and here we are yes go boy good job great puppy I'll walk around and he's on my left side again and here we go. There's that left foot heel. And we're gonna walk. It's so difficult to walk and hold the camera, but here we are. Um, you can see he's on my left hand side. And I've got him in a sit. I'm telling him stay. I gave him the verbal and the hand signal, stay. And I walked away with my right foot. I'm gonna, yes, look at me, good boy. Great job, I'm gonna walk around him, asking him to stay, and then walk away, leaving on my left foot. Now, as we do this again, he's going to sit, go boy, so not, and then here's that stay, with the hand signal and verbal, and I look, walked away on my right foot. Now, what we're doing is pattern training this puppy to stay with my body language of the hand signal and the foot. And then again, treating for the look or the attention on me while in public. Yes, good boy. Good job. Yes, good boy. I'm gonna walk around him. He's on my right side. I'm on, or he's on my left side. I'm on his right side. And you can see, here we go. Now, if you pay attention looking in the glass, you can see how nicely he walks next to me. Oop, there he is. And here we go again. Left side, and we're gonna do some of that fancy footwork stuff again. So the left foot means I want him to heal or come with me, and we use the proper, the proper training command of heal. Heal. Or, if I leave with my right foot, I want him to stay. And that's part of that pattern training. There I go, stay, and I'm just stepping off in front of him. This is actually the first time we had ever done this behavior. Not getting a lot of looking from him. He's avoiding eye contact because this is an awkward position for him. It was something new, a new phrase he heard. Stay, step off in front of him, so I'm doing it again. Oop, 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 ah, 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 was our um, verbal cue to stay in place. So ah, 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 when he broke that stay, and it is actually really hot, it was 78 degrees. So you see him panning, we're in the sun. Oh, I'm not gonna fix this, because right now I'm really concerned about him staying. So he spun around, I'm fine with that. And you can see he's on my left side. I led with my left foot. It's really hard to record and hold a camera and not walk into someone. So I apologize for some of the awkwardness. But you can see how nicely he walks right next to me. And then here we are at our favorite destination or probably our second favorite destination. It's Three Dog Bakery. It's a delicious smelling dog bakery um, that is loaded full of toys and treats and we're gonna go in for um, a special treat and to greet one of our good friends here 
at three dog. He's great. Now this place is usually full of dogs, so um, it's great for socialization, distraction, interaction. Um, when we were leaving this afternoon, several dogs um, had come in and he stayed really um, good during the entire interaction. He got his cookie. We broke it up into probably a good two or three dozen little bites for him. And because he's a chunker, he ate the entire cookie. But here you can see the little guy. He's like, oh, I'm not sure. The bite was too big, was what he was looking at me about. And we ended up breaking him down into even smaller pieces. And you can see here he is chomping him down. But anyways, super good puppy. He did a great job today. We worked on healing, which means walking on my left side on a loose leash. I use my left foot along with the verbal cue of heal to tell him I want him to come with me. My right foot along with the um, hand signal and the verbal cue of stay to tell him I want him to stay. And we're doing an awesome job. Thanks for watching.